There is nothing quite like match day inside a football stadium, especially when there's so much on the line. The build-up has been intense, and now we just can't wait for us all to begin. It's anyone's guess, though, which team will come out on top in front of a packed house. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live from the Bernabeu here on EA TV. It's very much a temple of football, the Santiago Bernabeu right here on the Spanish capital, Madrid. I'm Derek Ray in the commentary position and I'm joined for expert analysis by my partner Stuart Robson. And we've got so much to look forward to. This is where it all begins in Europe's Premier Club competition, the UEFA Champions League, the group stage, match day one action. It's Real Madrid facing Manchester City. Well, the first game of the group is so vital. You just can't get off to a losing start. This could be a tight battle today, Derek. Bernardo Silva sliding it through. Oh, the keeper made it look routine. It was anything but. And let's dissect the Real Madrid side. Nacho Fernandez plays with Antonio Rudiger in central defence. Federico Valverde plays alongside Eduardo Camavinga in the centre of midfield. And the main striker today is Kylian Mbappe. And a look at the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson stands between the posts. Rodri plays alongside Kevin De Bruyne in the centre of midfield. And the lone striker today is Erling Haaland. Kylian Mbappe! Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Ederson. Mbappe. He fancies it. Brilliantly blocked. And he's fired over the corner. A goal that is out of this world! I don't think anyone expected that, not least the goalkeeper. And I have a feeling we'll be seeing that time and time again. Incredible! Well, just look at this piece of skill. He times this absolutely perfectly. Great connection as well. We'll see this for years to come. Fantastic goal. Up call for the City players, maybe. Can they find a response now? Vardiol. Well, that's how to put in a clean tackle. Carvajal. Mbappe. The keeper was never likely to be in trouble then. Rodrigo he's given us away Grealish on to Silva and it's still on marvellous anticipation Good work from Real Madrid to win the ball back. Phil Foden. Walker. Foden. Here's De Bruyne. Must be! Oh, couldn't pull them level. Well, they certainly should be level. That was a great opportunity to score. Well, frustration for everybody, particularly Pep Guardiola. What a chance to equalise that was.
Rudiger. Real Madrid unable to hang on to the ball. Mbappe. Mendy has it. Beautiful pass. Wasteful from City. Kevin De Bruyne. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. He's got to have a go here. Well, it turns out to be fairly routine for the keeper in the end. Rudiger. And the defensive intervention there. to get that spot on and did fantastic challenge well as you can see City have dominated possession in the last 15 minutes and they've created chances they just haven't had that end product you just get a sense now hold on Stuart they're in here and a really good stop well, that's a save of the highest quality. Great goalkeeping there. And De Bruyne firing it over. Well, defensive Brazilians there. Holland. And saved by the keeper. Favouring the short one. Well, beating his opponent. But a good piece of tidying up. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Oh, in with a chance! And he scored not once, but twice. They simply cannot stop it. And no wonder he's enjoying himself. Well, here's the replay, and just look how quickly they break forward once they win the ball back. And Mbappe just hits it with such confidence. He strikes it so cleanly. It's a great goal. Well, that's not a happy manager at all. Pep Guardiola knows he's got a lot of work to do now. So underway again, and a 2-0 advantage here. Badiol. Oh, he fancies his chances. Well, just centimetres away, narrowly wide. Yeah, but the goalkeeper had it covered, no doubt about that. I think he would have saved it. Diesch. Almost at half time, and they're making home advantage count, I think it's fair to say. Stuart, your thoughts? Yeah, they're playing really well here. They've controlled the flow of the game, they've won their individual battles, and they've created numerous chances. Their only problem in the second half could be complacency, but I can't see that happening. Well, the ball back with City here. And the emphasis is on creativity. De Bruyne. 
and you've just witnessed a moment of truly high-class goalkeeping. You're absolutely right. What a save that is. He's reacted so quickly. Well, they fancy a short one. Holland. Well read to ease the pressure. Clear foul, but a Real Madrid advantage. Nacho Fernandez. Eduardo Camavinga. Beautifully weighted ball. Takes the shot. A gift for any goalkeeper. De Bruyne. A very effective challenge put in. And Bellingham. Well, nothing comes of the attack when all is said and done. Manuel Akanji. The ball with Rodri. Racing forward, trying to catch them out. And that is that half-time here in the Spanish capital. Well, choose your descriptive word where Kylian Mbappe is concerned. Explosive is one adjective you could use, Stuart. Well, he scored good goals, but his all-round play has been excellent. He looks like scoring every time he gets on the ball. So the second half underway, and City left with a real mountain to climb. Holland and tidy defensive play. Vinicius Junior. Mbappe. Look like a certain goal, but that's a great challenge. Walker. Holland. Foden. Angles it back. Walker. Now with Silva. Determined defending. Jude Bellingham. Mbappe. Vinicius. Wonderful chance. And just putting it over the top. A change in the offing for City. And the advantage is with City. Mateo Kovacic. On to Holland. Foden. Running with the ball confidently. Huge block. Real might threaten on the flank. Oh, that surely had to go in. But marvellous defending. And Manchester City will go to their bench. Who's going to get on the end of it? 
Well, he would have been disappointed had he spilled that one. He has teammates around him. In with a chance. Well, goodness me. Well, even though he tried to place it into the corner, he's missed by quite some distance there. <laughs> 30 minutes left for play. Possession seeded by City here. Well, this is not ideal for him. He was booked earlier. Well, maybe a little fortunate, Stuart, not to see a second yellow. Well, he has to be careful. That's a really silly challenge. Rudiger, Nacho Fernandez, Eduardo Camavinga. Rodri. Well, moving the ball around nicely as they try to get themselves back within a goal. Oh, he's lost possession of the ball. Foden. Now the cut back. Fine tackle there to prevent the chance. Well, not giving him any breathing room. Counter attacking, very much an option. And Bellingham. Will it be? Well, that was a terrific attack, but they'll be disappointed about the way it ended. Well, it's good play. They force the error, break forward quickly, and create the opening. However, the finish didn't match the rest of it. Mateo Kovacic. Well, they have the ball once more. Vinicius Jr. Can they hit them on the counter? The referee has decided to give the free kick decision the way of City. Well, just a rebuke rather than a caution, Stuart. Well, it's not a bad tackle, and the referee's got that right. Effective challenge. 20 minutes to go in this one. Oh, great attacking play. And based on that challenge, you wouldn't be at all surprised if the referee reaches for his pocket. And he does produce the yellow card. Yeah, and it certainly deserved the yellow. It's a poor challenge, you have to say. Well, he can't believe that decision. He's not happy at all, is he? Well, so close to extending their lead there. Just a matter of inches. And the challenge halts them in their tracks. And Bellingham. On to Mendy. The supporters want to see him have a go. Oh, that is... 
is a wonderful piece of challenging. Well, that's wonderful attacking play. Really have to get it spot on to finish from there. And it was miles off target. Well, maybe not the right choice there. That's a poor effort. Now they have elected to go to the bench at this stage of the game. Mateo Kovacic. Can he find the right pass? Now well, disappointing end to the move. Chance maybe to use the counter-attacking ability to good effect. Defenders need to cover. Bellingham has come off the keeper. And a goal it is. But in all honesty, the keeper should have done much, much better. Well, here's the replay. Yes, it's a decent shot, but the goalkeeper has to do a lot better there. He's parried it out into a dangerous area, and suddenly the ball's in the back of his net. It's poor goalkeeping, you have to say. It's a massive lead, and it's very hard to imagine them losing it now. Manuel Akanji. And a strong tackle. Grealish. Watered by the post. It was an attack of promise, but they couldn't take advantage of the situation. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Kylian Mbappe. Oh, great goalkeeping. Well, that's a top-quality save. Great anticipation. Let's see about the delivery. On a corner like that, every goalkeeper's dream, really. Foden. Rodri. Well-timed tackle. Mbappe. Just have to make sure they don't get caught on the counter-attack. A City free kick forthcoming. Kovacic. And a good challenge to bring that attack to an end. Valverde. It's with Vinicius Junior. Vinicius! And that, a piece of goalkeeping you're going to see again and again and again. <laughs> Corner kick played in. Well, the goalkeeper made it look as though there was no pressure on him whatsoever. Rodrigo. That's a nice-looking ball. Appeared to be in two minds. A glorious chance. And the keeper nowhere to be found, not that he's complaining. Well, 
here's the replay and it's a simple finish in the end but where was the defending that's just not good enough well he knows his team haven't been good enough in this game but how does he change it a lopsided contest 4-0 So full time it is, and a morale boosting three points on the board to begin their European campaign. Well, you always want to get off to a good start, and that's exactly what they've done here. Now they can look forward to the next game. They're in a great position. Well, choose your descriptive word where Kylian Mbappe is concerned. Explosive is one adjective you could use, Stuart. Well, he gave that back line a torrid time, didn't he? He was far too sharp for them, always looking to play on the shoulder, took his goals well too. Clearly the difference maker today.